I'm actually nervous. I don't know why. Oh, wow. All these times people staring at me and they're laughing. I felt his knuckle. I caressed the knuckle with my tooth. This is the fruit they warn you about. It's actually really bad. Oh, Nassi, look at this care package. Culture Kings, this guy, what are they sent? Timberland, stop it. Top of the range shoes here, boys. Timberlands, let's oge. Armani. Bro, I legit didn't even know they sell Armani. How they moving up in the world? This cut, brother. But they got chains and all, oisies. They got ain't chains and all, lad. They got chains and all, bro. And they got the gunners clothes, culture kids. Go on their website, I've got a code for you. So you get 15% off everything. The code's Spanian. Anything on their website, check it out. Culture Kings, let's oge. Everyone, welcome back to another episode of This All Eats. We're in Chinatown, Sydney City. Hay Market, uh, the Friday night. Chinatown, street, Asian street food markets. It's every Friday night. It cranks here. I grew up around here, I'm not gonna lie, right? I swear on anything, I've never actually eaten at these markets. I know there's this little like cream puff plate. Anyway, let's get into it. I'm actually nervous, I don't know why. This is a tent from East Ocean Restaurant. East Ocean, I used to go to this restaurant. It's like a real high class restaurant. Back in the days, when I used to have Andal Bay's lad, Il Che, Il Che. Bro, straight out. Straight out, I've seen it. All right, I'm down, straight out. Chicken claws, they call them. It's chicken feet. Have I ever ate a chicken feet? Of course not. Why would I eat a chicken's foot? Hello, nice How are you? Can I get tiger prawn dumplings? Two, two. Um, Chicken, yeah, feet, feet, yeah, yeah. Fish balls? Yeah, a box, yep. One box, one box? Yep. Anything else? Yeah, please, and... Anything else? Can I get the fresh chive and seafood dumpling? Yeah. Just two of those, please, two. Thank you, yeah. And I told you, hot sauce, everything. These are the prawn dumplings, and these are the... I can't remember what they're called. Chive and seafood dumplings. Let's oge, Baba. Dumplings are hectic, come on, straight off the bat, gun food. Dumplings are mad, I'll give them a, a rating. Hectic, bro. Hectic. I'm eating another one too. Yum, very sweet, very sweet. And because I put heaps of soy on it, sweet, salty, and then spicy. What a combo, what a combo. The sriracha, look at my sriracha. Sriracha overdose. This is the chive seafood one. Oh, wow. Wow. Bro, they're hectic. I don't know how they're made. It's like they sweeten it up with sugar, it's nice. Bro, these are fish balls, right? A good old fish ball, right? No, YouTube, not TikTok. Everyone's saying it's from TikTok. No, I'm not on fucking TikTok. No one likes TikTok, right? It's just recycled content. I'm a YouTuber. Pull up. <laughs> that's nice. Like a cream curry, you know, like, you know, it smells like that's what it's in. It tastes exactly like that too. Spicy. Sort of like a semi satay flavor, like a light hint, of, light hint of peanut, you know what I mean? Fish balls, I'm gonna be honest with ya. Fish balls are pretty rubbish, right? It's not like real meat. I don't know what it is, but it's like the fish version of Spam, put in balls. It's like you're eating rubber balls, I'm gonna be honest with you. That's the last one I'm gonna have. <laughs> Straight out. Bro, come on, have a look at this. Look! This is chicken's feet, and you can see it's little, little, it's, it's little fingerprints, right? You can see it's little fingerprints, bro, no. Bro, it has a fingernail. It has nails. Oh, bro. All right. So there's all these Chinese people staring at me and they're laughing. They're all looking at me and laughing because they know what's, a, what's going down, right? I felt his knuckle. I caressed the knuckle with my tooth. Brother, I'm done, I'm done, I'm done. I ate it. I'm gonna tell you what it tastes like, right? You, when you hold it, you can feel the skeletal structure inside. When you look at it, you can see it's fingerprint and fingernails. When you bite it, your tooth caresses the bone, 
and when you chew it off and put it in your mouth, it tastes like you got a whole bunch of chicken skin. No meat, no nothing. So imagine peeling off the skin off a chicken and just shoving all of that into your mouth. That's what it tasted like. There's still random bits of skin hiding in the caresses of my mouth. Oh, here we go. The wog in me is getting excited seeing meat on a sizzle. Gotta get lamb, brother. Spicy, of course. Is there any other way? Uh, you mean like, I don't know. It was a rhetorical question. <laughs> Make sure you food porn that. Who knew that Chinese people do lamb shish? Let's go, lamb souvlaki from Beijing. We'll see what it tastes like. It's full gun. It's full lovely. It's mad lamb. It's fatty, it's fatty lamb, right? It's soft. It's spicy, right? Nothing kills me more than when people say it's a spicy, you want a spicy version, you just get the full rubbish, like tastes like tomato sauce. Good quality lamb. It's got a nice smokiness. Like I seen it was, it's not cooked on a big barbecue, like flames everywhere this start. It's cooked on a little grill. But considering that, it's still got that smoky flavor, like little burnt bits, this and that. It's gone. Fish tofu. These are like little things on, a, on sticks, right? Cheese sausage. Chicken fillet, mushroom. All right, I'm gonna get cheese sausage because it's unique. Thank you. Brother, what is that sauce that you're dipping everything in? Yeah. Oh, sweet and salty. Oh, yeah, yeah, sweet, salty, and spicy. You dip everything in it? A little sugar, yeah. Oh, yeah. And everything goes in that and then in that. Sexy chicken. It's looking sexy already. Yeah, thank you. Let's go. Sexy chicken and cheese sausage. That actually smells mad. It's like a process, right? You get your order. They got all that stuff in the window. You get your order, and then it's like they just, it's like all chucked together, you know what I mean? Like a little hot pot thing, boom, in the sizzle, and then it goes through the process. Like it goes into the sauce, and then they sprinkle it with the herbs, this and that, and then that's how you make sexy chicken. It's gonna be hot as unti, junti. Gotta watch my wording, you know? I'm a professional YouTuber now. You can't just drop like the bombs that I usually drop. That's hectic. What does it taste like? It's like, exactly how he said. The bloke explained it, what are you talking about? Spicy, salty, a little bit sweet with herbs on it. That's what it tastes like, it tastes mad. Fried chicken, let's see, what do you want? What else do you want me to say? Wow, fried chicken. All right, cheese sausage. So it's like a frankfurt, like a little frankfurt, you know? I don't know where the cheese is. Oh, so the cheese is like made so it's not like they sliced it open and put cheese in. It's like in the production of the sausage, cheese was added. <laughs> and now it melts because you cooked the sausage. I don't know, that's a bit red hot to me, but let's oge. Oh, it tastes so unhealthy. I'm going to tell you straight off the bat, but I don't care. It tastes hectic, but bruh, that's unhealthy. Oh, you, you know when you bite something and you just know? Like, that's not healthy. It's, <laughs> but the cheese is very cheesy flavor. Very cheesy. And it's, and it's covered in that sweet stuff. It's just hectic. I'm smashing this one too. Uh, can I get Chinese sausages, uh, grilled tentacles, and pig feet? Are you speaking on a speaker? Yeah. <laughs> Spun me out. It's like talking to Darth Vader. She spoke and I just come everywhere. I was like, what the hell? Struck in a pose now, by the way. I've always eaten here in Chinatown, ever since I was a kid. They used to have, which, you know what, they got less now. They have like, you know, when you go and you go in the secret door and you go downstairs and it opens up and it's just like, it's some like little food court, you know, sly one and there's stores everywhere. They had like three, four of those pumping here back when I was a kid. Even like seven, eight years ago, they had like one or two left. I don't know, like, Everything else that's good in the world, it just seems to go. I'm just left solo. Remember when we come here, there was like, I was mustering right now, look, look, it's just me. 
I'll tell you the truth, it took that long, I forgot what I ordered. <laughs> Let me try to remember what I ordered. Oh, no way. How are you, how are you, how are you? Okay, take a photo. Yeah, come, come. Oh, fuck yeah. This, uh, multitasking. I'm oh, getting yeah, photos with fans, I'm looking after the fans, <laughs> and I'm doing food reviews oh, at the same time. Much. Squid tentacles. Shit. I don't know what marinated is, but... Thanks for that. All right. Have a good one, brother. All good, all good. It's unusually hard. You know when you buy octopus and it's very, it's firm, right? It's firm. This was like hard, like, like buying through an apple. <laughs> so much flavor, but mad flavor too. That's spicy as I love that. I'm in heaven here with the spices. I think they knew. Bro, I can't get over how hard it is. My mouth actually, for the first time, out of all these feeds, my mouth's burning. Pig feet. You know what, this isn't as rare as you think. This isn't like, all right, chicken feet, all right, relax. Pig feet is actually not that rare. It's not like some unusual thing. There's pig feet in all, like, multinationalities around the world make their versions of pig feet. I've never had them. <laughs> I'm just telling you facts that I know, general knowledge. It, you know what, I'm, I'm looking more forward to this because it looks like a cut of meat as opposed to a foot. It's not like I'm looking at a foot, you know? So we'll see. Wow, that's hectic. Wait a minute, so what is this then? I don't understand, oh, it's hectic. It's full, juicy, tasty, fatty pork. I can't distinguish what part of the foot it is, and I'm glad I can't. Because if I, if I noticed what part of the foot it is, I wouldn't be able to eat it anymore. I like how we're just claiming the middle way. So everyone just walk around. <laughs> hey. My hands are dirty, but yeah, let's go. It's a pleasure to be yeah. I, I wouldn't mind that traditional drink, right? But I'll tell you what, it's, it's cold and they're icy drinks, but I'll cop it. Yeah, strawberry, please. Now, what's your favorite? Mango passion mixed. That's it, brother. That's what you're giving me. Mango and passion mixed. Spanish, how do you spell that? S P A N I A N. Spanian. I've got to spell the Spanish. Yeah. Okay, have a look. Ooh, he's right. No way, brother. Durian. Durian. This is that fruit. This is that. This is that. This is the fruit they warn you about. How about they sell it here? I'm gonna cop it. I'm gonna get it. I've been actually wanting because people have been saying how oh, it stinks. This oh, I've been sussing it out, bro. They re Whoa, what the fuck? It's a heresy food. King's fruit. Try heresy food. Whoa! You know, like natural gas, like cooking gas. It smells like that. What the fuck? That's insane. <laughs> it's okay. Okay. It's okay. Tastes like onion, but sweet with like honey. That's what it tastes like. Honey and onions sautéed with a little bit of a cooked taste. That's what it tastes like. When you're biting it, it's releasing like the smell of gas. Thank you. Thank you. Oh, it's all right, sweet. The durian, it's so strong. It's so strong. Just the remnants in my mouth is like letting off natural gas. When I'm talking, I can smell my breath. It's going like gas, like, like onion, bro. It's, it's actually really bad. This actually looks grouse. They got like sticks, like kebab sticks with like strawberries on them, like glazed. And they look, it looks hectic, you know what I mean? And then there's a, like a woman over there like mixing up some you know, the cold plate ice cream stuff, like doing that. So this, this, this looks hectic. But, but it's leaking all over me. Look at this. What do you mean? It's dripping everywhere. But what are they? 
What are they? I thought they were strawberries. Upon closer inspection, I do not know what they are, but they're some type of fruit with like covered, look, it's dripping down my hand. It's like dipped seven or eight times in some type of gloss. Oh. <laughs> Whatever that is inside, I still can't work it out. It's um so sour. Like a really, really sour fruit. It's like trying to like squint my eyes. It's that sour. A toffee on the outside that's like crumbling like glass and it's really sweet. That's actually gun. I wish I knew what fruit it was. I can't work it out, bro. Anyway. Bro, I'm done after this. Look at the presentation on that. It's beautiful. She started off obviously with the ice cream base and got like mandarin and like chopped it up into it, like smashed it and smothered it in. Like fresh mandarin, you know? It wasn't like froth, you get a Coles and you get mandarin flavored ice cream. She got actual mandarin, you know? And then rolled it up, made it look like a rose and here we are, about to demolish her. Bro, I'm actually so happy that I got mandarin. It worked out so well. Who would have thought? Fresh mandarin chopped into ice cream. That's beautiful. Wow. Hey, wow. <laughs> Full going off my area. <laughs> you know, remember we had um, Lakemba? And then ice cream, Oreos. They got the same things here. They're good, I guess. I guess it's like ice cream and it's a, like, you know what I mean? Across all races, you know? Like, speaks to all of us. All right, that was um, Sydney City's Chinatown Friday Night Markets. Goes on every Friday. First time I was here. I'm shocked how busy it is. It pumps here. It's actually mad. I'm actually very happy to know that, and it, it's not even like a one-off event. I'm happy to know that every Friday night, it full pumps like that. The food's gun. The food's what you expect it to be. Everywhere from the stock standard to the peculiar foods that the Asian food has to offer. Um, there was even a couple little freaky things. We had paella, this and that. Um, mad food, happy with this place. Come suss it out, yeah, what can I say? Let's ouch.